Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my channel. This is the original one and only Silo Man, coming to you from an underground launch control facility in a former Atlas F intercontinental ballistic missile base outside of Roswell, New Mexico, USA. Over the next 16 minutes, I hope to be taking you through some of the work that we've just completed two weeks ago. And I'm, again, I'm sorry that I'm behind that far. Hopefully in the next few days, I'll be bringing up at least two more videos to bring you up to date with exactly where we are. For example, we're gonna be going through a lot of the kitchen. But where we're standing right now is we're just finishing up on some of the trim, both the chair rail, the baseboard, and uh, the crown molding. And that you're gonna see in this next picture here, you're gonna see Manny as he's working around on some of the trim. You see that one piece of chair rail that we still need to put in. We'll be putting it in, and of course, as we're going around, then we'll have to fill in all the little cracks. That was Kerry, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what he did. It just, it just, it went south in a. <laughs> but anyway, as you can see here, this is a work in progress. So expect some noises. Um, anyway, you can see we're starting to put up the crown molding there as we're coming around. To me, it's really a finished product. Once the crown molding goes up on top of those petitions, to me, it looks much more finished. And of course, once we get it, you know, all uh, bedded down real nice, and then we'll come back and put some paint on it. And to me, it really all starts to come together. And you'll see us here as we're going back around doing some of that work. see my semi-made bed in the background and there we're coming around the wall all right here you're having as we're still moving around now we're in really the living area of what we've done or the the open recreation area for this business And you can see on the electrical side, that's going to be an opening for what we call the emergency backup lights. <clears throat> of course, we have the DeWalt in the background where we're making all the cuts. Once we get the trim in and get it painted, then we'll go ahead and do the final coat on the upper portion of it and on the, and on the lower portion of it as we come back around. Well, I've got some exciting news for everybody, hopefully in the next few days. Um, <clears throat> probably sometime next week, we're gonna be starting up. It's not gonna be a great pump. We're gonna, we're gonna pump probably a few hundred thousand gallons out of one of the silos here. And we're gonna take you all along with us to show you how we do these kind of things. So. And there you have it, we're, we're going back. You can see the open doorway there that leads to the storage area and what we're using now is, is a temporary kitchen. And the chair rail looks pretty well completed. And we're coming around now the wall where that area you know, behind there is our temporary kitchen, which will be used for storage eventually once we get the cabinets and the sinks in. <clears throat> and Carrie's just finishing up in the office. Um, we're, we're, shrinking down from a quad box into a duplex which is just simply one, one standard electrical outlet and then carries or then manny's putting in that one small section of chair rail we'll be starting to paint we're still waiting on uh, in, in these photographs we've just barely gotten uh, i believe towards the end you're going to be seeing 
all the vanity for the for the bathroom and then at that point we can finish the baseboard not only in, we've got to finish the baseboard in this utility room here that you see on the left side of the photograph <clears throat> and then of course once the cabinets get in play then we'll go ahead and finish out that where Carrie's sleeping we're going to be moving Carrie into the other area he needs lots of room And there you see Carrie is working on that one now. Uh, on that one outlet for changing. And he's wiring in the plugs at this point. Probably, uh, I'm going to say maybe next week, we're going to be starting on the switches and the lights. Uh, we have all the emergency backup lights and the signage we'll be starting on, but. As for the true light fixtures, other than the bathroom, I'm not sure yet what we're going to be doing in the kitchen area. I'm still playing with that, and also in the uh, in the office and in the uh, um, storage area off the office. And there, man, he's going around almost on that last section. You can see just a couple shorter sections for the ground mold. But to me, it gives it so much a better look. It's, it's almost a finished product in terms, even though it's only a, it does not have a ceiling. It's just ba basically a floating petition. Uh, it just looks so much more finished to me. And there you have it, we're putting in some of the GFIs. That's just Carrie making noise. And there we're just about finished up with the office slash bedroom. And then Manny's going around putting in the crown molding in the kitchen. See two of the kitchen cabinets there. And we're finishing up around the receptacles now. Went ahead and just muddied those. See some of the extra baseboard we've got there. We can't wait to finish. It up. But once we get the once we get the kitchen base cabinet set and also the vanity in the bathroom, then we can come back and knock out the rest of the the baseboard trim itself. Get that all finished up. That's just Carrie moving his chair. He really wants me to play some ZZ Top, but I can't because they'll flag me for copyright violation. So I just, we're kind of stuck, you know. We just, I have to turn it off while we're, we're while I'm doing the voiceover here. So we're kind of bummed out. And there you see Manny doing some work. receptacles themselves and in fact we put in all 20 amp uh, receptacles. And Carrie bought a couple new tapes but the new tapes just didn't work out. I've never seen anything like this but then he bought them at the dollar store so what do you expect? Right? You know, One dollar and the 
take three at one time. So. And you can see we plaster around the outlets now. Let that dry and then we'll hit it with some paint. Once we get the once we get the trim painted. And this of course is the office. And there we're starting to clean up. You may notice all these little signs on the, the center column. Carrie's gone along and tried to get an idea of exactly where every position of the compass lies on the column itself in terms of the on the surface. And so it's it's been kind of fun right now. We got a piece of string hanging down. So we're taking bets on who's going to be the closest to do north. So. I'm just about finished up in the office. Right now, Carrie's working on painting the trim. Um, it's a long process for Carrie. It's it sometimes it's just a matter of you know concentration. He's laughing. I'm smiling. <laughs> and there you have. There's the uh, storage area on next to the office. See my makeshift closet right there. A little chilly today. Today is the 27th, or excuse me, 17th. We just got back from Los Angeles. So I'm kind of doing this self uh, quarantine, just in case I may have picked up a bug. Inadvertently, we landed there last Wednesday. And, uh, we were going to go to a concert Friday night. And we had booked this thing six months in advance. Seemed like all of a sudden after we arrived on Wednesday, everything just went to, pardon my expression, but to hell in a handbasket. And so as soon as we could get back out of Los Angeles was Saturday night, of course they canceled the concert, which that's fine. And uh, we couldn't get back out of Los Angeles uh, until uh, Saturday evening. I think uh, I'd never, first time in my life, uh, and I basically grew up in so never seen it before with any of the stores that basically there was a run on obviously all the toilet paper and things like that. I just never seen anything like that before. I'm not quite too sure why toilet paper. And for those of you that can't tell, you're about to see here in just a, a few photographs uh, exactly what occurred. Here we're bringing in some more of the, there, there's the vanity for the bathroom. And now we won't have to shave on the utility. Well, we've had to bring in some two before, so obviously we're going to build a wall. And you're going to be seeing that in the next video. Well, again, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this. Again, I, I, I know sometimes it can get a little boring, but we're hopefully going to be able to spice this up a little bit. And uh, uh, if you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. We sure would appreciate that. Also, if, you, if you're new and you'd like to be a subscriber, we've got a lot more interesting things coming up. And again, thank you so very, very much. I should have this up, well, probably within the hour now. And then I'm going to be working on another one, just because I didn't want them too long. And so anyway, again, thank you for watching. 
and uh, we'll see you soon. And Carrie says bye. Carrie, you're going to play the air guitar? <laughs>